Whooping cough is an upper respiratory infection that usually afflicts infants. It is named after its main symptom, coughing bouts so severe that victims gasp for air, making a whooping sound. While whooping cough is almost unheard of in the developed world today, in the 1930s, it killed more infants in the United States than polio, measles, and tuberculosis combined. Enter Pearl Kendrick and Grace Eldering. Kendrick was born in 1890 in Illinois, Eldering in 1900 in Montana. They were whooping cough survivors and both went on to study the biological sciences. Lucky for infants around the world, they ended up in the same Michigan laboratory in 1928, where they began work on a vaccine. Unfortunately, their work coincided with the Great Depression. Without adequate funding, Kendrick and Eldering were forced to do research on their own. But by 1936, it was clear they would need real investment to complete the necessary trial. Desperate, Kendrick invited First Lady Eleanor Roosevelt to the lab. Amazingly, Mrs. Roosevelt accepted and was so impressed by their work that she found enough funding to facilitate a 5,800-child study. The trial was groundbreaking, eventually leading to a vaccine that is now routine. While whooping cough still kills thousands in the developing world due to uneven vaccination, Kendrick and Eldering's vaccine has saved millions of lives and opened the door to eventual eradication. For this reason, Pearl Kendrick and Grace Eldering are our 15th Heroes of Progress.